quick, Claude. Now's your chance to win Gordon his certificate. There's only Lord Turret and Thunderclap to beat. Come on, Gordon. Let's go. Goodness, Claude. Be careful. Yeah, Mum, pamper those tired racing feet with my luxury foot spas. Buy one for each foot. <laughs> come on, come on. Hurry up, old chap. Oh, I say, leave that bush alone, Thunderclap. <gasps> oh, uh, oh, Claude, watch out for that muddy wheelbarrow. Come on, let's go. No, no, leave the bush alone, Thunderclap. Oh, I can hardly watch. Come on, Claude. Come on. What the blooming blazes? Come on, Claude. <laughs> Just imagine that certificate. Come on, come on. Oh, no. Oh, Claude, you did ever so well. I tried my very best. I'm really sorry we came last, Gordon. I really wanted you to win the certificate. Oh, oh my goodness. Well, I thought I'd never catch up with you all. Who won? Lord Turret and Thunderclap did. Yes, well, let's see now. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Oh, no, no, that won't do at all. Oh. Well, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Well, I am delighted to announce that the winners of the Great Poor Haven Runaround are Claude and Gordon. Us? Well, yes. Everyone else ran off when I accidentally waggled my starting clacker. So you all didn't hear the most important rule of the Great Poor Haven Runaround. The winners are the team who cross the finish line with the cleanest hanky. And that's you, Claude and Gordon. Look, there isn't a speck of dirt on it. It's so clean. That's right. I remember that rule from when I was a boy. Oh, so that's why you were being so careful and not rushing. Yes. Although, I think it was my fault that everyone started the race early, Mrs Mayor. Sorry. Don't worry, Claude. I should have been more careful with my clacker. And we shouldn't have been making so much noise. And should have been listening. Oh, yeah. Well, you should have listened. <laughs> yes, well, so without further ado, it gives me great pleasure to present Gordon and Claude with their winning certificates. Well done. <laughs> Yay! Yay!